good day. Now, what are the strategies to reduce or manage stress and burnouts? Because in life, we get burnt out, burnt out. Difficult situations appears to burning us down. What are the strategies? Bhagavad Gita gives a very different perspective. Now, let us take up. Please understand, very important is in the Gita, many of your stress is because you are too attached. Attachment creates a lot of stress. Situations are not stressful. Situations can be challenging. But attachment, and what is attachment? Without this, I refuse to be happy. My point of view, I get attached. That's why my guru is to say, whenever you point out mistakes of others, look three fingers pointing towards you. So attachment is one of the biggest causes of stress. Tasmat asaktaha satatam karyam karma samachara. Lord Krishna says, with detachment live your life. A little example for you to understand. Reflect on this example. A person goes to astrologer and says, I want a beautiful woman to be my wife. And the description should be like this. She should be like Hindu. The astrologer gets confused. You want her name to be Hindu? No. I want her to be like Hindu. What do you mean? Said the astrologer. Right? I, Hindu means moon. M O O moon. My wife should be like the moon. Right? She'll rise in the night and go away in the morning. I want my wife, right, to be like Hindu. Right? Comes in the night, goes away in the morning. Now look at this expectation, how his wife should be. This is how he suffer. Everybody has expectation. Lord Krishna says, stop expectation. Then what should I do? Bring in commitment. If you bring in commitment and not expectation, you will not be fretting and fuming. So can your strategy be bring in sankalpa commitment to handle your stress? So drop attachment and drop expectation. Like this person wants his wife to be Hindu. Second very important dimension is increase awareness. The strategy to handle burnouts, handle your stress is increase your awareness. In the last video also I spoke. If you want to read my last blog, right, the link is above. Right? Click there and read. I said awareness. I'm adding a depth towards it. Awareness. What should increase your awareness? See, we are sentimental to what is, says Lord Krishna. We are not sensitive to what is. When you are sentimental to what is, sensations become more important. But if you are sensitive to what is, whatever be the sensation, you will experience it. So sentimental, you react to what is. Sensitive means you will be sensible in relating to a relationship. So in the Gita, Lord says, Pashyan, Sprishyan, Jigran, Ashnan. Whatever you are experiencing, just experience the experience. Don't allow the past experiencer, past expectation to interfere into the experience. So awareness, I'm talking right now. Let me not bring my past. Let me bring awareness in what I'm seeing. There is freedom. So Lord Krishna says, the biggest strategy is bringing awareness. Then you will experience what is. You will not react to what is. Second important in handling your stress. Third important is bringing the dimension of yoga according to Gita. Lord Krishna says in the Gita, Dukkha Samyoga Vyoga Yoga Sangnitam. It is a revolutionary meaning. Generally, yoga means to join. Here Krishna says, yoga is disjoining to, from Dukkha and joining to Sukha. Dukkha Samyoga, you are joining to Dukkha Vyoga. Disjoin. So whenever there is an unhappy incident, disjoin. Whenever unhappy memory, disjoin. And join to what is. This is an art. An art cannot be taught. It has to be caught. Our next important dimension in the Bhagavad Gita as a strategy and you have to bring in execution, he is not self-love. It is cosmic love. You have to bring in cosmic love. We are all caught up in self-love. My community, my 
my jati me don't bring self love bring in cosmic love when you bring in cosmic love right you will have a balanced approach towards life when you have a balance you will cater to your family you will also respect some other family and yukta ahara vihara sya balance everything that should be a strategy and to handle your stress and your burnouts and very important is please understand learn to surrender when you learn to surrender or not ruminate on what you want you will experience alacrity and therefore surrendering is an art which cannot be taught surrender is when you have bhakti and therefore in narada bhakti sutra it is said parama prema swarupa ha is bhakti love towards existence not love towards only yourself is bhakti when you bring this then each one nara seva is narayana seva serving others is serving the lord therefore parasparam bhavayantaha you serve the community you serve other people there all right you are a social self and also an essential self please further read my blog in the description below and i have written a blog go through it more deeply read it but don't read it mechanically read it from your heart wishing you all the best